So you're back for another three horror games, aren't you? Well, it's nice to see you. Welcome back. Go ahead, take a seat. I'll wait. Grab a snack, maybe a drink as well. Get yourself nice and comfortable. Because today we're taking a few quick bites of horror. The first game on my list today is a game called Guests. And this title screen looks very welcoming. Let's see what this game does to completely eliminate that feeling. Ah, it, the immediate opposite of what I was experiencing in the title screen. It's time to go. Oh! Hey, dude, you scared me immediately. Hello. I'm here to repair your house. Kind of vague, aren't you? Step aside. <sighs> My dude, wait, wait a minute. Where the hell did you go? I mean, he was 2D, so he probably slipped through one of the cracks of the floorboards. Uh, I can't go in there. And now there's a very steep staircase. I can't go in here either. Guess I'm climbing up the stairs. Whoa, son, are you winning? What are they doing to the house? Tell them to stop. We can't afford it. <laughs> That's my son. Why does he have Lego hair? What the hell is going on, dude? Okay, it's just going to repeat the same thing again. What is happening here? Son, you are of no help. I hope you know that. I'm going back down and what? What the hell is this about? Just laid a plank down. Whoa, whoa. Did anything different happen in here? No, he's. That's the sound of me walking. This is confusing me already. I'm going down into the deep, dark abyss, apparently. Whoa. What the hell is this, dude? What is going on? I can't see shit. Hearing some kind of music. Oh. Uh. Oh, there you are. What up, dude? Anything else to say? Hello again. It seems like I'm finished for the day here. Can I have my payment? No. Well, looks like I won't be coming tomorrow. Then this place is just gonna have to rot. Step aside. No, no. Hey, get back here, you ass. Okay. Disappeared into the abyss. Well, that's what you get for upcharging me, my dude. It makes no sense. And I don't understand you now. Oh, um, I'm going to go talk to my son really quick. You wait here, son. Did you get rid of them? Good. We can barely pay for the treatment bill. For what? What the hell is going on here, dude? This is getting weird now. Let me go talk to this guy. Hello there. What up, dude? Why are you shaking like that? I don't like it. I don't like the trembling situation. And what have you done with my bed? And why do you... Oh, that is wrong. Are you possessed? Is that what's happening? You are sleeping. Oh, sorry for waking you, but you haven't paid your bills. So we took the chair upstairs and your kidney. <laughs> you might want to put on some band-aid if you have any. It's bleeding pretty badly. Sorry for the inconvenience. Have a great day. Thank you for taking my kidney. What? I can't move. Son? I'm hungry. Is anyone there? Hello? What the hell is happening, dude? Dude, what the fuck? I don't have any idea. Why am I going to take my headphones off? And oh, here we go. The beautiful, the lovely intro music. I don't know what I just played, okay? I don't even think I can review that because that was just beyond weird. I kind of liked it though. I like games like this that just feel broken in like an intentional way and just the overall strange, surreal nature of the whole thing. Good work. I like it. Anyway, that's it for guests. Let's go on to the next game. The next game I'm going to be playing today is a game called Stargazing 64. I believe this game was made in like a few hours. Is this? This looks a lot like Ocarina of Time. Yeah, I think this game was made in a few hours as more of like a test of 
making a game look like N64. And I gotta say, you did quite the job with this. This looks a lot like what you were going for. All right, let's go over here. Boom, oh, take telescope. When it is dark enough, you can see the stars. Marvel at them by holding the mouse button. Oh, okay. It, I don't think it's dark enough yet though. So how do I make it dark? How do I go to sleep? Oh, it's starting to get dark. Oh, okay, let me go atop this bridge. Yeah, look at this. Okay, cool. Very cool. Is there anything I need to be looking out for? Oh, name. Huiscuti. Distance 9,500 light years. One of the largest known stars. Oh, well, that's cool. Where did it go? Is that a different one? Beetlejuice. Oh, hell yeah. 548 light years away. Second brightest in the constellation of Orion. Okay, I dig it. The stars disappear after I look at them. <laughs> what is this one? Boom. Yeah. Wesson, distance 1600 light years, anchor point by which other stars are classified. Really? I didn't know that. Aha! I found you. Antares. Antares? 550 light years binary star that appears as a single star. Ooh, interesting. Ah. Uh, it has the same, it's getting closer. It is rapidly approaching. What happens if I just let it? Do I really have to sit here for, for this long? You know what, I lied. I don't have the patience for this. I'm getting out of here. It's still there though. Oh. Now it is approaching. Oh, I can see it getting closer, dude. Oh my God, that is, that's pretty crazy. It is rapidly approach. whoa. Whoa, dude. Okay. Did it stop, what? Oh, brother, little Majora's Mask situation going on here. It is very rapidly approaching. Look at that. Ooh. Okay. Uh, gonna come down anymore? Oh, what? Oh! That was really cool. Incredibly short, but really, really cool, I gotta say. I don't know why I found that so cool. The aesthetic was totally there. I mean, it definitely gave the vibe of like an N64 game. But if I ever played anything like that when I was a kid, I think I would never have stopped having nightmares. Either way, not a bad little like tech demo, I guess, if you want to call it that. This was cool. But enough of this one. Let's just get on right to the last game. The last game on my list today is a game called Parasitosis. At least I think that's how it's pronounced. This looked like a pretty disturbing game and it's very short so it fits right into the niche that I'm into. Let's play. Ah, ooh, oh, I have a character model. Mouse wheel to zoom. Examine bed. I can't sleep. Well, that's straightforward enough. Do I just get the hell out of here? What is up with the movement, dude? What's this note? Remember, Thursday at 4 p.m. I hate those doctor's appointments. Well, you better go. You can't just, ooh, eat examine door. I want to keep this locked. Probably a good idea considering I'm playing a horror game in this. It's pretty dark outside, especially considering the fact that I have the windows covered. But there's some examination going on. Cue to interact. Oh, I've sat down. Okay. What is that lump on my arm? Oh, <gasps> so itchy. Gross. That's disgusting, dude. Space bar. Oh, I gotta. Okay, I'm sorry for the clicking, but there we go. Three, two, one. No, 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 no. Big old no, big old no, big no, that hurt, big no. Wait, no, I'm not gonna wait. What is that? Oh, oh no, there's something in there. No kidding, dude, that is horrendous. Why would you do that? Arrow keys, arrow keys? What? Got it? Uh, more space bar. Ouch, I can't pull it that hard. Okay. Oh, uh, ooh. 
This is weird, dude. This is weird. So now what do I do? Space bar. Am I supposed to do this lightly? Oh, 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 man. This is so gross, but it's still so itchy. Don't continue. No, stop. This is what got you here in the first place. Don't. No, 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 no. There's so many. No, so many no's. Get them out. Got to get them all out. How did this happen? No, what are you do? No, what are you doing? What are you doing? Oh. 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 We're not doing this. No. 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 Everything about that was wrong. Say it with me. Everything about that was wrong. I hate that I played that. I hate it. I'm not one. I don't have trypophobia, whatever, however it's pronounced. But I think that just made me have it right there. That was horrendous, dude. And it seemed so unassuming from the start, the pleasant music, being in the room, you know, a little kid roaming around the room, checking all the different things. It went south immediately. I need to put my hood on and cover my entire face because that was, that was bad, dude. That was, that was really bad. That was really bad in a good horror game kind of way. Well, we had some very interesting games today. I hope you all enjoyed, especially that last one. As usual, if you guys want to play any of these games, I'll be leaving the links for them down below in the description. So be sure to check it out and support the devs if you can. Otherwise, that's going to be it for me. Thanks everyone so much for watching this video. I really appreciate every last one of you for taking the time out of your day to come to this channel and show me your support. It means the world to me, and it's exactly what keeps me going here on YouTube. So thank you. If you did happen to enjoy this video, be sure to hit that like button down below. Don't be afraid to leave me a comment. Let me know how you feel. Smack that subscribe button down below if you're new to the channel. And I can't wait to see you all in the next video. Take it easy.